five common beginner mistakes that you need to get out of your game, my friend, and we have the solution. Let's go. Issue number one, my friends, you want something for nothing. You can't get something for nothing. It doesn't work. The formula is TPP, technique, patience, and persistence. Like learning scales on the guitar or good pitch before you become a singer, you can play without learning them, but you're probably gonna suck. When you're hungry, you don't wanna go to the grocery store. You just want your food to appear directly in front of you. I get it. But the truth is, you guys, you're gonna have to put in the work. There is a small sacrifice that you have to make in order to get something, and this is what you need to remember as a beginner. If you put in all of the foundational work, everything in front of you will be easier. Most of the time, beginners and young players do not wanna do the things that will make their lives better in the future. You, now that you've heard this, will not make that mistake. Some of you are not willing to repeat. No repetition. What's that you're saying? I go to the field every day and I'm there. Isn't that good? No! It's not good. It's not good enough because we need to repeat the same actions over and over again. I understand we live in a fractured society. I understand TikTok is burning a hole in your brain, but you have to repeat the same things over and over and over again, and beginners don't wanna do it. They want a new shiny button and a new shiny thing to chase every single day. And what ends up happening is that over the course of time, you haven't practiced anything, you haven't mastered anything, and you're still a beginner. When the truth is, is that if you put in a month of training focused on the technical, fundamental skills and things that you should be doing, you would be balling before you know it. Well, the sun's out now. It's decided not to respect our filming time, but that's okay because we're ready for setbacks, which is the point of this right here. Some of you think you're gonna take a straight shot from beginner mode to ultra superstar. There's not gonna be any setbacks, no obstacles, you're just gonna shoot straight to the moon. That's not how it works. You go like this, and then something goes boom, and you start going this way, and then you give up a little bit, and then you're depressed, and you're sad, and then you think, why am I depressed and sad? I'm going straight to the moon. All right, my friends, in life and in the game as a beginner, know that you're going to have your ups and downs. You're gonna have days where you wanna train, you're gonna have days when you're motivated. It doesn't matter. You have to understand, put the idea, the template, the thing for where you want to be there at the end, and then don't worry about all this crap that happens in the middle. It's gonna happen. Just keep going. Mistakes. Some beginners, some crumble after their first mistake. This cannot be you. It is a common thing for most beginners, just like we said in the last one, to expect everything to go to the very moon. But you have to remember, after your first mistake, how you react is the big difference between beginners and amateurs and pros. Mistakes are expected, and because they are expected, they're ignored. If you're continually making mistakes, then you have an issue. If you make a mistake in a game, a bad pass, a bad shot, you miss an open goal, right? You forget to go to training, you, you forget something out, your, out of your bag. All this stuff are things that are going to happen. You cannot crumble after your first mistake. Do not react to that. Be someone who is going to create their world rather than someone who's constantly reacting to the things that are happening around them. That will make you better. Most beginners do not analyze their games. I understand the point at the beginner phase is to have fun, and that is truly the point of the game. But, but do you know what's actually fun? Being really, really good. When you're good at something, you can actually enjoy the game. You can actually enjoy the sport. And that's what we want from you guys. And you won't get there unless you analyze your game and figure out what is wrong, what can't I do. Every time I pass the ball, it goes left, and I'm trying to pass right. Fix it. Right? Start training those things. Beginners don't seem to care about any of that. Their only concern is to go out in there and run around and just let everything be chaos. Not everything is chaos. There are some things you can do to make yourself a better player. And if you analyze your game, you will do it. I was supposed to be a crossbar, so I just... 
That's the vid, my friends. Leave us a like, comment down below, and check out everything from us here at Unisport. As a beginner, you know things are gonna be tough, but keep going and don't quit. Crossbar. Crossbar. Hup, crossbar. Nailed it.